Hey everybody, we got a video to show you the details of the 3D printed parts. And we also want to talk to you about uh, some of the warnings we put on these as far as uh, they, they are a little bit brittle. Um, so we wanted to kind of go over that in this video. So we offer four different products right now. We got the M style engine, which is right here. We got the E style engine. We have a B style oil tank. And then we have a set of four uh, wheel discs for the wheels. So the beauty of 3D printing and the reason we made these parts like this is you, some of the headers get very you know intricate as far as the bends and there's just no way we can mold these. So the 3D printing is perfect for this. Um, you can see how it kind of wraps around and, and just really get a lot of detail. They are one piece. You can take the existing engine off. There are mounting holes on the back. You use those same screws to put these on. Um, when you're putting the screws in, just go really slow when you turn those in. Don't go too fast and don't go too tight. If you go too tight or too fast, the threads will strip out. But if you go nice and slow, get it up to tight, and you'll be good to go. Um, same thing with the oil tank. Just take the existing screws out of the car, put these in, and put them in these holes, and you're good to go. The wheel discs, um, two things on the wheels. Uh, we have two different color wheels, as you've seen on the website. We have a chrome and a black. The black wheel is just a natural plastic. The chrome has a chrome plating. So the hole in the middle is a little bit smaller where the wheel disc registers. So one thing you're gonna wanna watch is when you pop the front disc in, and the front disc is the thinner one, the rear disc is a little bit thicker. When you pop the front disc in, you just wanna get it lined up and just kinda push down with your both thumbs at the same time. Just kinda work it in and then you kinda push down in the center and it's there. To pop them out, um, just you know put the L Allen wrench or some kind of a screwdriver in there and just kind of work your way around and they'll just pop right out of there um, the rear ones are a little bit different you know there's a step in the wheel so when you put these in they'll go down in a little ways and then you got to just kind of push them down and just kind of work it down just be easy when you push it in there and it'll go in just fine same thing when you pop the rear out just kind of work it up all the way around and eventually it'll just pop right out of there if you try to pop these out at one time, they will break. Um, these are very fragile, um, so you gotta be, be a little bit careful with them. Uh, but they will kind of take a set in the wheel, so once you get them in there, they'll probably come out a little bit easier. Uh, but just take your time with them. Uh, another cool thing with the 3D printed parts is they do accept paint really good, so you can use like standard modeling paint. You can paint up the engine, the oil tank, your wheel covers, however you want. Um, so just be aware of these parts. We just want to do this video just to just to make you aware of that We do have a little warning on the bag that they come with about this as well Because um, we don't want you to break them or you know or and and have a bad experience right away with them So if you have any other questions on them, let us know if you have any other product ideas um, We can run out of 3d printed let us know as well and uh, thanks for watching